Jim spots the spider and is like, wow, it's not a big deal. To which I'd argue it is a big deal. That was a large spider. Also, the son's name is Michael. So Michael's like, no, dad, that is a big spider. Yeah. And if you miss, it's going to jump at you. Oh, absolutely. And those are, those have big legs. They are fast. Yes. That's moving. Yeah. Ugh. Nope. Not for me. Jim says a rolled up magazine is the best weapon to use on a spider. And I have to argue it's not. There's barely any surface area. There's a higher percentage of error. Mm -hmm. The best weapon is a flip flop. There's. Oh, I would say a Swiffer Sweeper. Oh, yeah. Well, actually, I use those. I use those for cockroaches in college. Yeah. But you're right. Maybe mm, depends because they they are floppy at the end. Yeah. So but it's just large flat surface area. But you want the more more surface area. I think there's less margin of error. Yeah. Mm -hmm. (laughs) You get the distance too with a Swiffer Sweeper. Yeah. But with the flip flop, you can swing quick and then run. Fast and and run. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. (laughs) He gets Michael to try to kill the spider, but he's too scared to. So Jim tries to turn this into a life lesson. It's a good lesson, but not for spiders. So their daughter, Megan, walks in. She casually casually just walks in and kills a spider. Yep. And I've had some of those moments too. Like there was one time in college, my roommates were freaking out and I got out of bed and just moved a mini fridge and killed it. <laughs> <laughs> to put a whole fridge on top of it? Yeah. 